Good morning guys, this is already the second spot that I'm trying today but uh, in the first spot I was looking for some asp and haven't been able to get a single bite, really nothing, it almost looks like the asp were in there. So right now I'm here and I'm planning to fish only for some dander. So let's just give it a try, I will try to fish with some soft bait. In the beginning and of course that I will just go with the other one from the last time that I was here, the orange one that caught two zanders the last time. Yeah, they were small and everything, but they were zanders. And somehow I have some hopes that some other zander will be here today. The weather it's just perfect for the zander so let's go with the first cast even the water the color of the water looks quite okay so my expectations and hopes are quite high even though I'm kind of disappointed because I fished for the asp perhaps a little a little bit more than two hours and nothing really nothing nothing even though I tried <laughs> plenty of lures and still not a single bite so all my hopes now goes to this spot over here Come on, tell me that this is a fish. I missed the first hit and here it comes. I think that this will be another fish that took the lure after. Yeah, that's not a big one, that's not a small one. It's a nice ender. Come on here. Here we go. Whew. So in the end, here it is first fish of the day are ready buddy thanks a lot <laughs> nice <laughs> I really don't know what to fish anymore I think that I already tried more than half of the lures soft base that I have with me I even tried some lipless and after that first zander haven't got nothing so I'm not very sure but I will just continue trying some different lures I'm not planning to change the spot or at least I don't have any idea where to go the spot from this morning wasn't that good because I haven't got any single asp in there, haven't got any single bite and uh, yeah perhaps that the best idea is just to insist here hoping that some more zander will bite. Let's say that my hopes are quite high especially after catching this first zander so I will just insist 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 I will change some colors I will change some different lures and hopefully at least one more zander will join us <laughs> the conditions seems to be just perfect for the zander because the water it's not as clear as it should be got a little bit higher than usual than it was lately not usual so let's hope let's hope insist and hope
Yes, come on. Oh. This feels a little bit bigger than the other one. And this guy took the lure really, really decided. No, it's not bigger. No, it's even smaller. But oh, the hit was just great. <laughs> I'm ready, buddy. Thank you. You hit the lure like crazy. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Come on, that was a hit. Huh. And that was a nice hit, I have to say this. Come on. It's true that my soft bait, it's quite big for the jig head, but... Yeah, here it is. Let's try. This is what I don't like when fishing for Zander. Because I'm losing lure after lure after lure. I don't have any idea how many of them I lost today, but I think that some around seven or perhaps eight. <laughs> Not only that you are losing the lures, but you are also losing a lot of time with making the knot and everything, so... This is something that I really don't like about fishing for the zander. I even try to use a thicker leader, hoping that I want lose as many lures as I'm losing but instead the main line will broke and uh, will break and yeah there is nothing you can do right now I'm trying to use a shorter leader than I usually would just to increase the sensitivity of the road even though I'm using this fluorocarbon line that I think that it's close to zero elasticity. Come on. It's kind of cold because my hands are almost freezing. I think that we have somewhere around 4 degrees right now. And it really feels cold. Come on. <laughs> also my patience, it's close to the end so I have around one more hour perhaps an hour and a half I haven't checked the time yet so I'm not very sure but more or less an hour an hour and a half and I really hope for some more Zander come on and now I'm not even sure Let's try this li this one here. Come on. 
Let's go. I think it would be better to use something a little bit heavier because yeah I have 12 grams and whew, I was thinking that I will lose this lure too no I need to go with something heavier because in this way I'm not fishing very well so let's give it a try with this one over here that should be 15 grams the lure it's a little bit slimmer and I should fish a little bit better yeah a little bit better not very good but it should work i don't think that i have anything between this and 20 25 grams this one is 15 i have 25 i don't think that i have nothing between with me so i'll just do my best to use this one over here and just try some different lures Come on! Oh, this guy hit it on the drop and I'm quite sure that it will be quite a small one but I really needed this fish. Yeah, that will be definitely a very small guy. Come on here, bud. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> there are days when fishing it's extremely extremely hard and today was one of those days outside right now it's extremely cold and for some reason the fish just don't move at all I don't know where is the asp I haven't seen an asp the whole day and luckily for me I was able to catch those uh, three small zanders <laughs> I'm really happy for them <laughs> Anyhow, right now I will end here this session. I'm extremely tired. It's really, really cold and I will just go home. Hope that you guys uh, enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Bye bye.